Yo, what's poppin'? It's your boy from the sea, they till Don checking in, and you're watching Fitted Fiend. Cause my sweat turned off right now. Kid friend looks going too turned off. Talking that talk, but it ain't about much. Hey, no nuts, cause the sweat turned off. This week on Fitted Fiend, we got a Liz New Era exclusive. As soon as I saw this hat, I had to get it. It's a collaboration between minor league and major league. They mesh in a little bit of, of both um, designs of their AAA affiliate with the Major League affiliate hat. I think it's a very cool concept. I wish that they would do it with a AA and single A affiliate. So far, it's only the AAA teams uh, have versions of these made so far. With no further ado, let's get into it. Order on Lids Online, did an in store pickup. Bag in the bag. All right, so it was normally thirty-four ninety-nine when my lids premium membership dropped it down to twenty-eight. Then with sales tax, bumped it back up to twenty-nine sixty-eight. Uh, lids receipt. You may be wondering why we're filming in front of the sneaker wall. It's due to some of the colors on this hat. Do not cooperate with the green screen for when we do the Fitted Fiend series normally. Alright. So, y'all know I'm not a big fan of the name change from the Gwinnett Braves changes to the Gwinnett Stripers. But, I like this because it's the Braves colorway with the, the Gwinnett Stripers logo. Once again, it's the AAA affiliate of the Atlanta Braves. So... Looks just like a traditional Atlanta Braves hat, with the exception they have the AAA team's logo on the front. The any logo's done in red. Unlike the on-field hats now, use the white New Era flag. Got the MILB logo on the back, which that's Jackie Robinson's silhouette on that, If you, for those out there that don't know. One difference, they put the Major League Affiliate logo on the other side. So this has the Atlanta Braves A on it. Very, very nice. Also love they went with a gray underbill on that. I'm a big fan of that, of gray underbills. This has four tags in it. It's got the 758, has the New Era, has the Major League Gentleman Merchandise, and has the Minor League Patch. So that's the first time I've ever seen a New Era hat with four patches, or tags, whatever you want to call them. Um, sewn on the inside of the hat. Very, very nice. Excited to add that to the collection. Still haven't got the regular on-field uh, Gwinnett Stripers hat yet. I'll probably get the, there's like four different versions of the Gwinnett on-field hats. I'll probably get the one that has this, the traditional fish logo on it. But uh, happy to, to get that. Liz does a little bit of exclusives, but they it doesn't touch Hat Club's um, exclusive game, in my opinion. But uh, hope everybody liked today's video. Please give a big, big thumbs up if you did. Subscribe down below if you haven't already. Trends Unlimited merch down in the description. Till next time, it's your boy from the C, the ATL Don, signing out. Peace. I can rock it to the left, I can rock it to the right, I can rock it to the back. Either way, it's looking tight. She like. Come on, baby, give me that. Colors, all teams, all crisp, all mean Cocked up with a lean, brand new Now I mean, so fresh, so clean Gotta rock the ice cream Flood the mess with a guest Now you see that ice gleam White stitch, see the seam Celtics, white and green Come through with white and blue Yankees, the magic jeans